Hello, everybody, and welcome to just another episode of just another Minecraft Let's Play. My name is Bigly Shrunk, and when we left off, uh, we were in the nether, and we had just found a nether fortress. Now, when I left off, I explored that nether fortress a little bit, and the reason why I say when I let, left off is because I had a video, well, I, or at least I thought I had a video. I wasn't even recording. I wasn't even recording. So I explored it just a little bit. I just got back from a little bit of a mining trip, a very unsuccessful one in if I do say so myself. Uh, I mean, I found a spawner, but it wasn't that great. Um, but yeah, we ended up f going through a little bit of the Nether Fortress. Luckily, I have not gone through the entire thing. I only just took one side and went in that direction. And we got quite a bit of stuff. If we look into the Nether Chest, we have plenty of blaze rods. Some magma creams, which I'm going to use here very shortly. Nether wart, soul sand, and I got some of these decorative blocks. And however, let me show you what I've been working on. Alright, so as you can see here, there is a little bit of a corridor here that leads into an extra bottom level. I started adding and decorating this little cave divot. And here is where things get very cool. I have a small brewing stand, and here's the one thing I got from my little mining expedition. <sighs> a wither skull. Now, it's the only one because in that... In that uh, fortress, that's the only one I found. Um, that is... There's so many, and I cannot stress that enough how many uh, wither skeletons there are. So luckily, hopefully we'll see them more and more. And that's what we're doing in this episode today. To make up for loss uh, surprises and loss um, excitement, we are going to be going out and exploring that other half of the nether fortress. So let's, let's go. Oh yeah, back to square one with this garbage. Yep, there he is. Let's see if I can hit him. No, I can't hit him. Well, he disappeared anyway. He despawned anyway. You know, I think while I'm here, I might as well get some more magma cream. Yeah, for the... For the potions. Oh, jeez, I completely forgot about this death trap of... I completely forgot about this death trap of a bridge. Made out of nothing but nether warts and... <clears throat> Super dangerous. Makes me nervous every single time. All right. We are back at the Nether Fortress. And as you can see already, there are some blazes and... And some wither skulls. There's going to be a double... Okay, now you see here, boom, he's going to run into there. And I can hit him from there. See, it's a, it's a foolproof plan. But uh, these guys are a little bit more difficult. Okay. Oh. Yeah, I'm not getting that back. Any, unfortunately. All right. So here is what would happen last time. I went exploring in that direction a little bit towards the right of the horrible, horrible thing. Oh. Okay. Um, but I didn't go left. And that's where we will be heading out this time around. Oh god. So yeah. We're gonna be heading left. And the crazy thing is, like I said, there are wither skeletons everywhere. So that's really, really good for us in the future. Because that increases our chances of getting... Really good, uh... Oh jeez, 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 oh jeez. But that increases our chances of getting more wither skulls in the future, which is really, really beneficial and really, really helpful to us. And we don't need that guy. So yeah, it'll be good. It'll be fun. Okay, so we just found our first uh, blaze spawner, and I'm actually quite terrified. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna plug that up for now. Oh god, they're above me. 
I'm gonna plug that up right now. Ooh, I almost just hit him. Uh, just so we can work on me turning that into an actual decent farm. Other than that, though, I think it's time to just keep on trucking along. I haven't found as much in this area, unfortunately, and I'm out of blocks. Perfect. Right? Perfect. Perfect. I just pow, block that up really quickly. Lava flows like 10 times faster in the nether, I think. Well, not 10 times faster, but like noticeably faster in the nether than it does. Is this a dead end? Okay, this is a dead end. But I'm going to keep this rather open because uh, wither skeletons might spawn in here. Okay, now off in this direction. Okay, I was already in this direction. But as you can already tell... It's just insane how- oh jeez, oh jeez, yep. oh gosh, oh gosh, oh no, oh no, okay, I'm gonna build this up, oh jeez, oh jeez, okay, 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 we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, I just gotta remember, okay, they're ruthless, but yeah, look at all these guys, they are really out for me, aren't they, they're really after me, huh? How did you spawn? Time out. How did you spawn? I need to know. You're supposed to be dead. Look, I got more blaze rod though. Ooh, I almost just walked right into that fire. Hello, dad? Here's another wither skull. Pow! Oh god. Again, I would not be surprised in the slightest if we found a spawner or another skull in the very, very near future. So again, we're just gonna come over here. Pow. 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 Okay. Now we're gonna. Yeah, get, get. Boom. And that's how you win. Alright, so here's where things are getting a little. A bit shaky because if these guys keep spawning everywhere and causing some issues. Okay, boom. I found another wither, uh, not a wither spawner, a ghast. No, that other m monster that shoots fireballs. A blaze. I found yet another blaze spawner right over here, but it is packed. It is packed. How the hell did that even happen? Okay. Oh, no. oh shoot. Okay, so my shield just broke. That's a problem. That is a small, small, small problem. And also another... I don't think I've been down here. I don't think I've been over here. Well, at least I thought I was, originally. We're gonna build this over just in case. Because I do believe that there are some wither skeletons down here. Yep, there they are. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Again. There we go, boom. Oh, it's these guys. Shh. I just got... Double teamed with. Yes. Shoot. Shoot. Go away. Okay. As you can see, there is where I was exploring of in the last quote unquote episode. I got more magma cream though, which is really, really good. But again, uh, gonna collect some of these for some potions of weakness. Uh, I'm gonna collect. I think it's time to. I think it's time that we kill these last two more skeletons. And then we attempt... Oh, jeez. And then we attempt to make our way... Oh, my gosh. Why am I still eating? Okay, there we go. We attempt to make our way home. That's the big attempt. Big word on attempt. 
Oh, I just realized I am almost dead. Oh my gosh, I just realized I am almost dead. We will. I will see you guys back at home. Alrighty, I uh, made it back in just almost, maybe quite possibly one piece, question mark? I don't know if one piece is a fair thing to call this, cause holy cow, it, it was rough. I will admit it was, it was rough. So I think the plan now is to restock up we got plenty of uh, crazy, crazy things, like weapons and s all this spectacular, fun stuff. We're going to clean up a little bit, do some housekeeping right now. I think plantation would go right there perfectly. Oh, and some nether blocks. Take some of these with us. And we are going to go digging, because I don't think I have any glass. Oh, I do have glass. But not enough, so I'm gonna go out and grab some glass. Oh, look at our farm. The farm looks so good. Oh, and there's plenty, 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 plenty of sand right over here. I can make a small little bee farm here real quick. Wait, wait, come back, come back, come back, come back. You need to mate, you need to make baby. I gotta have a nice little bee farm, pow, look at that. There's my bee farm. So I will be overpopulating the world with bees. Okay, so I, I got the glass, but I got enough just to make, um, I got enough to make, uh, just to finish off my stone pickaxe, or sorry, shovel, my stone shovel. And here I have some extra stuff over there. I think here's where I'm gonna have like my ingredients, right? Like stuff for potions. I, and then these are going to be my potions, potions. I'm going to add more storage because I don't think this is big enough. Maybe that's what I'll do is expand this out farther. I want to upgrade this and make it look better. And I think I know how I want to do that. So I got to take all this dirt and maybe some of this gravel. I wish I had more gravel, but I guess I don't. Yeah, I don't. So we're going to have to figure out something else to do with the the floor, which I don't mind at all. I could do something like mystical like this. Uh, we do have some moss blocks that I could go out and I could go out and farm some moss with uh, all these bones, question mark? Bones. With all these bones that I have. Ooh, I need to make a room. the hell was that? Did I drown somebody? Somebody got drowned. And I don't know who or what got drowned. But I forgot that I need to start putting this stuff together for my sugar cane. Because everybody... I can only make four books right now. Again, I'm trying to piece together books. I keep forgetting that. I need to put books together so I can have a proper enchantment room. Now let me double check and see how much redstone I have. Cool. I found, I already found, I know where some redstone is um, down in the caves. So I'll go grab that really quickly. Right after I'm done making these books. I can only make six right now. Or eight. Sorry. Okay, so that'll only get me eight. Um, we put that in the tools box, and I only have enough for not that many, honestly. Like, I have enough for six bookshelves, which isn't terrible, but it's not it's not great either. So, yeah, we're gonna, just going to make those up really quickly as well. So we're going to take all of those, pow, pow, and we're going to put this, pow, pow. Pow. So we have six lovely, lovely bookshelves and decoration blocks go over there. I'm going to raid the villages as well. So that can be a thing. Some more glass. I'm going to make these bottles now. And I'm going to make more than a few. Ooh, there's one last one.
how. Mm -hmm. And these will go in building blocks. Yes, I feel like that's building blocks. Decoration blocks. I don't have any dripstone yet, but I have this really cool idea for this automatic healing. This automatic fully, uh, filling, sorry, um, cauldrons, which is just simple as putting a source block, then a dripstone, and it's it's as easy as that, really. So yeah, let's put this together. Um, and while this is doing its thing, I'm going to go down and try to locate that, uh, trying to locate that, um, redstone, sorry, I was losing my mind here, losing me mind, but yeah, I'll definitely try and locate that redstone that I found down there. All right, I'm pretty sure the redstone was down here somewhere in these caves because I remember the lava and putting out this lava around here, maybe? Ah, here it is. Yes, here's the redstone I was looking for, which is very, very good. And this will allow us not only to make more redstone contraptions because um, I have plenty of farms in mind, but I also... Ooh, some more. See, and there's some more up in this area right over there, too. I... When exploring this cave, I didn't really bother getting it because I didn't know how much I needed it, really. Like, because I never... Redstone isn't something I really go for. Because I... Like, redstone can be a very early game item. But I don't think it's... For me, personally, since I don't know how to really use redstone all that much, I just don't... I don't see a use... I don't see a way I could use it very effectively. Other than, say, a couple of my friends who we have a realm together. He, they use it, and it's very effective. Me, I only know how to make like a sugarcane farm. And maybe a decent redstone door. Like a 2x2 two two redstone door. So yeah, nothing too special. Nothing too out of the ordinary. But yes, let's put together... And let's put our very last... Holy cow, I got so much from that already. Yeah, I'll be fine on redstone for now. So ores and pow pow. I got some prismarine crystals from the chests from a couple episodes ago. I just thought of that and I was like, ooh. Um, yeah, I want to do something with this copper too. I just don't know... I don't know exactly what I want to do. And what do you guys think of this? Since you guys didn't get to see it um, when it was being completed... I'm curious, like, what do you guys think of this uh, whole contraption? Like, what do you guys think of this whole thing? All right, now we have our very first potions, fire resistance. So we're going to put that in our chest, and we're definitely going to bring this with us next episode. And next episode, I actually plan on going down into the nether depths and finding some netherite. And I know it's very, very early on in the game to be doing that netherite stuff. But I just love it so much. It's such a cool, um, it's such a cool like bl like way to get some extra armor and iron. I have a couple of diamonds, not enough for some decent armor. Hell, I don't even think I have enough gold. Okay, maybe I have some gold. I have enough maybe for like to complete a set of uh, to complete a set of armor, maybe. All right. But my next goal plan today is to finish up this area because I know last time I was saving it because I wanted to do it in the next episode when I originally did it, the original episode six. So in theory, this is episode seven. Um, but unfortunately, it can't be episode seven at the moment. So check this out. We're going to have this kind of join in with this a little bit there and this is where all the birch wood will go I'm probably gonna add some more Ooh, that's right I don't want this to be here actually I do want this to be here because this is actually gonna go pow pow okay now I'm gonna add some more of this again this is just a very very sloppy sort of way to join this all together. Okay, cool. Again, I want this place to look like, I guess, quote unquote, the the lore. B 
behind it is the fact that this is a very, very cool um, building. And I need to cut down some of these sprucewood trees as well. So let me just go to sleep. <sighs> ah, hmm. Rise and shine, everybody. So yeah, right now, uh, I'm going to cut down some more of these spruce trees. And make sure that... Oh, I see you guys. I see you guys. Oh, yeah, I lost a lot of my stuff. And I died the first time in another episode 5. So, yeah, again, this is episode 6. Um, that was supposed to be episode 7. And I'm really... And I feel really bad that I... You guys didn't get to see the, uh, like, the thought process on the building that uh, potion room because I was really I went through about three or four designs before finally landing on one I really really enjoyed um, you know I showed off some testing I showed off some stuff in my test world I showed off some extra stuff in a lot of this extra stuff um, it was just like you know because I I think sharing the thought process is just as important as showing the process itself really so yeah i'm kind of bummed out that i didn't get to share with you guys that all right but however i i do like mixing the spruce and the birch wood however here let me go into building blocks okay, i do have some wood let me go into okay so i have spruce stairs i do have some spruce stairs that actually saves me quite a bit of time because this will then go pow in theory, this will go pow. Yes, and this will go pow. Pow, 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 pow. Okay, good. Now that I know that this kind of curves up, which I want it to, because this is just going to be an extension of this here, and this is going to go pow, pow. So yeah, well, I'm gonna, I don't know if what I'm going to change this to. I kind of want to keep it there, because the lore behind it was that this is a very unfinished building. You know, it's a very, very unfinished uh, cavern, and like tiny outcove within the the finished house or like the soon to be finished house however i have a cool idea for also the brewing room that i just wanted to share up again part of my thought process here i wanted to share with you guys here i found this little opening here and this reveals the bottom of my shop like the roof of the thing. So if I had a pillar going leading up and I had like this cool, if I could turn this into like a really cool like cavern thing, I could have my enchantment room bursting through here and I could have multiple entrances through. And like, again, the idea behind this entire base is underground, uh, rough living while also being unfinished and add some mystery as to like what this could have been what this should have been or and then leading into other rooms perhaps going out this way or this way or even up into this big cave i hope to have up further into the mountain in that area hoping that there is something more uh to leave something to the imagination which i think is very 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 important as far as getting this done. Okay, but here's my process really quickly on this. Something as simple as that, just to make it in. I really do like this as this. Um, I can make some of these here. Just so, again, unfinished. Very uh, kind of leaving it up to the imagination, really. But while I fixed that, let me go ahead and add more of these stairs here. Um, I don't know how many stairs I'll need, but I think maybe 20 is not enough. I, I just have a feeling that 24 is even not enough. Gosh. Spruce, like stairs, the stairs recipe is such a scam. Let me tell you. It is, unironically. It is such a scam. Ooh. I forgot about the sheep. I can't believe I forgot about all the sheep that we have. I got a... I gotta feed them so they don't, you know, die. God, I'm a horrible, I'm a horrible father. Oh, okay, cool. I did grab the hay bales from that 
I did grab the hay bales from that, uh, one of these villages, like either over there or over there. I can't remember which one. But here we have it. All right, come get the grub. Come make bebe. Now that they are doing that, I don't feel like I have enough to kill, I mean to uh, harvest them for food, unfortunately. But we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. All right, now I want to just see what this looks like um, in, oh, no, 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 that's definitely not it. All right, we'll see about doing one of these and then we'll close it off like that. Okay, and it looks like I might actually have enough. Boom, that actually doesn't look bad at all. That doesn't look bad at all. All right, now I'm just gonna do the really boring part and just complete this look, just to make sure that this is all the same cobble. All right, so I finally finished the corridor and uh, I'm definitely gonna, in the future, add some more detail because right now this looks very bare. But if we come down here, we can see that I added a lot of cobblestone and it's very, it's sprawled out, right? So again, to add that lore or like that mystery of unfinished and kind of half left half you know there um i don't know what i'm gonna do here i might have this have be like some nether and have like it make it look like the nether is bleeding through onto this which i think would be very very cool because it almost looks like it naturally to make it look like it naturally uh spawned here again i left a lot of stone bare and some you know just to make it give it that like mystery and give it that uh this quite was not finished yet look um hopefully we can just refill that up really quick i'm gonna refill the other one as well and i'm actually gonna go ahead and follow through with this other idea i had with going up going up here to the and this will be the nether or sorry the the enchantment room so let's just dig up here a while and see what this place really has to offer I'm kind of out of the way right now because I'm pretty sure this is the only way up so I think we need to go in this direction at Oof, that's actually startled me. I think we need to go in this direction, actually. So if we have that there. Okay, so there's the grass. So I think we're close to... Okay, yeah, here's where the our little opening is. All right, so if I somehow give this a proper... Hmm. So if I somehow I'm able to give this a proper sort of uh, send off, not send off, a proper uh, opening. I think that's what I'm looking for. So if we take this and this, ooh, yeah. So again, mixing, love mixing these uh, two uh, colors. We're actually going to make this deeper here. So let me uh, brainstorm and experiment because I don't want to go too far in and break this because that would be very bad. See, I don't want that. So yeah, let me do some more brainstorming and we'll come back to see what this looks like in the end. Alrighty, I think I have something that I really, really like actually. And if you noticed, there is a big ass window. So we're gonna have this, our very, very first window. I'm gonna make it like a nice, cool, uh, I'm gonna make it match kind of this. Uh, excuse me, I'm gonna make it match this a little bit. I'm gonna like do a little like hybrid of these two things, kind of keep the theme, right? It's gonna, and the window's gonna be big, right? So I'm gonna have this divot as a windowsill and I'm gonna put like potted plants and stuff in here. But however, this is very simple. It just goes up and around like so. And here we have the upstairs for to, pre to prepare for our enchanting room. And I think it is going to look so freaking good in the past time. Ooh, I do have a couple of glass. So yeah, let me do some 
fun window stuff here. Um, just to see what it looks like. Because right now, let me look outside here just to see. Okay, okay, okay. I have no idea what I'm doing. But honestly, this, oh, I don't know what this, this, or this in the wood chest. Ew. I don't know why I put this stuff in there. I feel ashamed. We have so much wheat. Now we do, at least, because I stole, I mean, borrowed. I borrowed some of that stuff from the, from the village. Okay, I don't even know why I say borrowed. I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it for forever. Oh, that looks so cool. Look at, look at the farm. It looks so cool. But yeah, this is gonna be a nice window. A nice, nice window. And it's gonna be big and thick. It's gonna be a thick window. So I'm actually gonna keep this. And we, this needs to be, this needs to match the outside of the window quite a bit, actually. So we are actually just gonna take this and do one of these. Because I feel like this is the best thing to do. Again, big window, big, big window. It's gonna be the best damn window you've ever seen in the history of windows. And that's a fact. But, I feel like that has to wait until the next episode. Yes, I am ending the episode right here and right now, and you can't stop me. So, if you enjoyed this episode and all the other episodes that I do, feel free, do you mind, guys? Feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It really helps me out a ton knowing that you guys are enjoying this content, encouraging me to make more content for you, beautiful, beautiful people. Now, again, uh, all my socials are be linked down in the description below, and I hope you guys have a great day, and be safe.